So before we get into this, I want to make something known to you guys. My laptop is basically falling apart at this point. I mean, seriously, most of it is broken at this point, and I am having to use a lot of convoluted methods to even record this. Um, currently, the audio is being recorded on my iPad, and I'm transferring it over to my computer. Basically, my computer no longer knows how to output bass or knows how to actually record audio. So I am unable to do that, but I am still finding ways. It's just gonna be a little bit more complicated for me to do more complex videos in the future. And I am trying to figure out some possible methods uh, to fix this. So just wanna let you guys know that, but I do still hope that you enjoy this video. So yeah. Hey there guys, Portalmaster9351 here, and in this video we are basically going to be doing a huge breakdown of everything we know about Skylanders Imaginators. Now this is going to be the first in a series of three videos that I am doing over this long weekend. Um, I have enough time to make these more complex videos and sort of, you know, um, edit them and make them look really nice. Um, and so today's episode will be uh, what we know about Skylanders Imaginators, tomorrow will be about what we don't know about Skylanders Imaginators, and then Monday will will be about when we'll find out more about Skylanders Imaginators. So it's sort of an info thing on Skylanders Imaginators, so I do hope that you will enjoy not only this video, but the other two in the series. Now, the first thing that I do want to break down is just some introduction to the game. So, Skylanders Imaginators is Skylanders 6, and it is basically the newest thing in the realm of Skylands. So, in this game, you will have um, new characters such as senseis, and you'll also be able to create your own characters via uh, creation crystals. So, yeah, um, that's pretty much it for the basic info. So now let's jump on into the next topic. All right, so the next topic is the starter packs. So what can you get in these starter packs and for how much? Well, there are going to be three types of starter packs for various consoles. Now available on all consoles will be the basic starter pack that will come with Kingpin, Golden Queen, and a Fire Creation Crystal. So two Senseis and one Creation Crystal. So you're basically getting $40 worth of figures uh, plus the game. That will retail at $75. And as I said, that will be available on all consoles. There will also be, on all consoles, a Dark Edition Starter Pack, which will come with Dark Kingpin, Dark Golden Queen, and Dark Wolfgang. In addition to those three senseis, it will come with three Creation Crystals. The Life Creation Crystal, the Dark Creation Crystal, and the Fire Creation Crystal. Now, as I said, that will be available on all consoles, um, and it will retail at $100. The third starter pack will be exclusive to PlayStation 4, much like the Nintendo Starter packs um, had exclusive characters. The PlayStation 4 starter pack will also have exclusive characters. These packs will contain, uh, it will contain Golden Queen, Kingpin, Crash Bandicoot, Neo Cortex, and the three creation crystals that come in the Dark starter pack, which would be Life, Dark, and Fire. Um, so this will retail also at $100. And it will be available, you know, in the same day of all the other packs. It's just, if you want Crash Bandicoot and Neo Cortex on launch day, you will have to get them in this starter pack. Now, uh, contrary to last year, you will still be able to get Crash and Cortex in a single pack, in case you haven't heard that yet, around November, the end of November. So, you'll still be able to get them, just the starter pack is basically the launch exclusive version. So with that, with that out of the way, let's move on to the next segment, which will be about all the characters and variants that we know of so far. All right, and now for the characters. So for tech, we have Dr. Neocortex, an unknown tech swashbuckler, an unknown tech bow slinger, and Dr. Crankcase. For life, we have Crash Bandicoot, Ambush, Boom Bloom, and Chompy Mage. For Fire, we have Ember, Flare Wolf, and Taekwon Crow. For Earth, we have Tri-Tip, Barbella, and Golden Queen. For Air, we have an unknown Skylander who everyone assumes is Wildstorm. We have Airstrike, and we have Bad Juju. For Magic, we have Mysticat, 
an unknown magic bowslinger, and Peñata. For water, we have Kingpin, an unknown water quickshot, and Grave Clobber. For undead, we have Chopscotch, Pit Boss, and Wolfgang. For light, we have Aurora and Blastertron. For dark, we have Starcast and Hoodsickle. And receiving his own element, we have the Chaos Figure. So in addition to these characters, we do have six confirmed variants as of now. For darks, we have confirmed a Dark Kingpin, a Dark Golden Queen, and a Dark Wolfgang. And for other variants, we have a Halloween Chopscotch confirmed, we have a Christmas Chompy Mage confirmed, and we have a Steel-Plated Hoodsicle confirmed. So as of right now, it appears as if Skylanders Imaginators will have 10 levels, and we do know these 10 levels names. So the first level is called Cradle of Creation. The second one, Mushroom River. The third one, Scholarville. The fourth one, Shelmont Shores. The fifth one, Sky Fortress. The sixth one, Fizzland. The seventh one, Golden Arcade. The eighth one, Dragon Temple. The ninth one, Abandoned Amusement Park. And the 10th one, The Layer of Chaos. So pricing for Skylanders Imaginators is pretty straightforward. We have single pack creation crystals that will be available that will cost $10. We have creation crystal triple packs that we can only assume will cost $25. We have uh, senseis that will cost $15 on their own. And then we have uh, adventure packs that we can only assume cost $25. We will also have double packs, but we do not currently know what they will be, although we are estimating anywhere between $20 and $25 is what those will be priced as. And then of course, as I said earlier in the video, we do have the starter packs. The general starter pack will just cost $75, whereas the dark and crash editions will cost $100 various reports as for what will be in wave one and wave two but the latest reports are stating that wave one will contain for single packs chopscotch ambush barbella dr crankcase taekwon crow and wolfgang for creation crystal singles it will be air light magic undead water and life and then there will be two triple packs with creation crystals one containing water air and life and another containing magic tech and undead there will also be two combo packs one with wolfgang and an undead creation crystal and one with mysticat and a magic creation crystal there will also be an adventure pack with airstrike plus an earth creation crystal and a, an observatory uh, level piece. There will also be a mystery chest releasing on day one. Now there are three varieties of mystery chests, a uh, bronze, a silver, and a gold, but we do not currently know which one it will be. Many people, however, are assuming that it will be the bronze mystery chest. Um, this listing contains a Crash and Dr. Neo Cortex expansion coming out on day one in wave one, and that may be the case for some locations, and some locations may not receive them. There are also three core three packs that have been mentioned, but I won't go in depth on those because we don't currently know much about those. For wave two, though, we have Tri-Tip, Aurora, Hoodsickle, Ember, Mysticat, and Starcast, and then two Creation Crystals, Earth, and tech. So we'll have to kind of wait and see if those end up being correct, but as of right now, that is our Wave 1 and Wave 2 list. So of course the most important detail out of all of this is the release date. When are we going to be able to get these things? Well, the current rumor states that Wave 1 and Wave 2 will be available both on launch day. But when is launch day? Well, there are three different release dates for three respective regions. So. The people that live in Australia, the Aussies out there, will be able to get Skylanders Imaginators first, being able to get it on October 13th, which is a Thursday. Now, those in Europe will be a little less lucky, and they will receive it on October the 14th, which is a Friday. Now, the Americans, my fellow Americans out there, are the most unlucky of all because we do not receive it until Sunday, October 16th. So, we'll have to wait the longest, but hey, it'll be worth the wait, guys. So, yeah. 
So that is pretty much all that we know about Skylanders Imaginators. There is a lot more stuff that we are speculating on and that will probably be revealed soon. So stay tuned tomorrow to see my video where we talk about everything that is yet to be revealed and we sort of do a little bit of speculation upon what's yet to be revealed. And then after that, we will be talking about when we will be finding out the rest of the information on Skylanders Imaginators. So I do hope that you enjoyed this video, even though I had to go through quite a lot of convoluted methods just to get this recorded. Recorded. But anyways, this has been Portal Master 9351. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye!